can't register on e-filing portal because you don't have a PAN. Don't worry. If you have Aadhaar, you can obtain a digital PAN or e-PAN free of cost, instantly. Please note that e-PAN has the same legal validity and uses as a physical PAN card. To use the instant e-PAN service, you must be an Indian citizen, be an individual who has not been allotted a PAN, have a valid Aadhaar and mobile number linked to Aadhaar. You must also not be a minor on date of request, not be covered under the definition of representative assessees under section 160 of the Income Tax Act. With this service, you can get an e-PAN based on Aadhaar eKYC. Update PAN details as per Aadhaar. Check the e-PAN request status and view and download your e-PAN. You can then register on the e-filing portal based on eKYC details after allotment of e-PAN. Let's start by looking into how to get an e-PAN. On the e-filing home page, click instant e-PAN. On the e-PAN page, click get new e-PAN. On the get new e-PAN page, enter your 12-digit Aadhaar number. Select the I confirm that box after reading and understanding the conditions given below it, and click continue. Read the consent terms for generating a new PAN, and click the I have read the consent terms and agree to proceed further box. After that, click continue. On the OTP validation page, enter the 6-digit OTP received on the mobile number linked with Aadhaar. Click the I agree to validate my Aadhaar details with UIDAI box and click continue. On the validate Aadhaar details page, your Aadhaar eKYC details are displayed. Please note that if your Aadhaar mentions only year of birth, you need to update your complete date of birth in the Aadhaar database and then apply for ePAN. It is recommended to validate your email ID from your Aadhaar eKYC for the PAN database on this page. If there's no email ID listed, you will get the link email ID option, by which you can enter your email ID to link it, followed by OTP validation. Click validate email, and you will receive a 6-digit OTP on the email specified. Enter the 6-digit email OTP, and click submit. Note that you can continue without validating your email and can do it later. Click the I accept that box after reading and understanding the conditions below it. Then, click continue. On confirmation, a success message will be displayed. You'll get an SMS with the acknowledgement number to the mobile number specified in your Aadhaar eKYC. Note the acknowledgement number for future reference. Now, let's see how to update PAN details as per Aadhaar eKYC. For this, your PAN and Aadhaar need to be linked. Watch the link Aadhaar video to learn how to link them. To begin the process to update PAN details, click Update PAN on the ePAN page. On the Update PAN details page, enter your Aadhaar number. Select the I confirm that box if the conditions below it are true in your case. If you do not fulfill those conditions, you will not be able to proceed. Click continue. After reading the consent terms, click the I have read the consent terms box, then click continue. Enter the 6 digit Aadhaar OTP and click I agree to validate my Aadhaar details with UIDAI. Then, click continue. On the next page, your Aadhaar eKYC details are displayed alongside the PAN database details. If you did not verify your Aadhaar email ID when generating your ePAN, you can do it here, though it is optional at this stage. Select the details to be updated as per Aadhaar by clicking on the respective checkbox. You can update the following as per Aadhaar details, photo, name, date of birth, gender, mobile number, email ID, address. Then, select the certification box stating that you linked your PAN with Aadhaar and click continue. 
The details selected to be updated will be shown in a pop-up. Click Confirm. On confirmation, you will get a success message along with the acknowledgement number of the request. Now, let's see what you can do with the check status download ePAN feature. On the ePAN page, click continue on check status download ePAN. On the check status download PAN page, enter your Aadhaar number. Click continue. Enter the 6 digit Aadhaar OTP and click continue. On the next page, you will see the status of your ePAN request. When your ePAN is allotted, you will be able to view or download it from this page. Once your PAN is allotted, you need to register yourself on the e-filing portal. Click create e-filing account. You will be taken to the registration service on the e-filing portal. After successful registration, you can log in. Refer to the register on the e-filing portal video to learn more. Now, let's see how to view and download your ePAN post login. After logging into the e-filing portal, click view download ePAN from the services menu. On the check status download PAN page, enter your Aadhaar number and click continue. Then, enter the 6 digit Aadhaar OTP. Click continue and you will be able to view or download your ePAN from the next page. There you go. The instant ePAN service enables you to do so much in a paperless, free of cost and instant manner. Connect with us for more information.